Last year, um, Alex DeFerks and I went through a bunch of documents which belonged to her grandparents, Pavel Voronov and his wife, Olga Klan Mikhail Voronov. Alex kindly gave me some of the documents for my own collection, uh, and somehow among them, we didn't recognize a letter from Grand Duchess Olga Alexandrovna, which she wrote in response to a sympathy letter from the Voronovs about the death of her mother, the Dowager Empress Maria Fyodorovna. The Dowager died on 13 October 1928. Voronov's letter to Olga Alexandrovna was written and sent on 16 October. Olga Alexandrovna's response was written on the 27th of October. 16 10 28. Your Highness, we just received the woeful news of the demise of Her Majesty's Sovereign Empress. We are deeply shocked by this news which orphaned us doubly as Russian subjects, as well as those who parted here on earth with their deeply beloved chief. My wife and I beg you, your highness, and your family to accept our sympathies as loyal subjects. The three of us with our little daughter pray daily and will continue praying for the deceased soul of Her Majesty along with our dearly beloved, previously departed family of the Sovereign Emperor. I respectfully kiss Your Highness's hand, your sincerely devoted Pavel Voronov. This is the letter, uh, or rather a postcard, uh, from Olga Alexandrovna to Pavel Voronov in response to his sympathies letter to her. Um, as you can see, it has a um, black border for mourning, um, and that's kind of like what tipped me off in a way and made me look up the date um, and uh, match up the, um, the death of a family member. So here we go. Darling Pavel Alexeyevich, Heartfelt thanks for the warm sympathies. Yes, we are all orphaned now. We and the children stayed in Denmark as it is not worth running around looking for new places and Nicholas Alexeyevich has a job in his field, but it is completely impossible to live on his salary. I notice that the wealthier people are, the more miserly they are. Our boys are awfully good, they are already 11 and nine and a half years old. They are good students at home for now, learning Russian with excellent tutors. Ksenia also thanks you with all her heart and we all send regards and good wishes. Again, thank you for your letter. Your loving Olga, 1427 October 1928, Klampenberg.